Surprise! We're in Nashville, Tennessee! We are so excited to be on a couple's trip! Are you excited? It's gonna be exciting. <laughs> Where's the enthusiasm? We're going to some shows, have some friends here. It's gonna be great. Our friends don't show up until really late tonight, so we won't see them until tomorrow morning. But I'm just so happy to be here. I'm just so happy to be with other adults for an extended long period of time. It is past lunchtime. We only have had breakfast at 3.30. I think we're gonna go get some food and Matt got a recommendation from a friend to go I where? He said to have chicken. Chicken. Hot chicken in Nashville. And our Uber driver said, Hattie B's baby. It's 0.9 miles from our place, so we should check it out. I think we're gonna walk there and see what it's all about. I don't eat chicken, I'm a pescatarian, but he's gonna try it and he'll tell you if it's good or not. I don't really think about like Nashville and chicken, but. I think about meat a lot. I know you think yes. about meat. <laughs> and it's known for its chicken, that's what he said. <laughs> Let's see if it's any good. time because now there's a line, line out, out the, the door. door and it takes forever to get like through that line so it's gonna be like a two hour wait but their pickles and their baked beans are delicious as well it was a good choice mm, oh look how cool yeah -hoo -hoo. it's beautiful Hot tub. Hot tub. cabana Hot tub. Here's the gym. I would die to have this gym in my house. We can make a gym in our house. Oh, it's so beautiful. So cool. All right, guys. I just finished getting ready to go out. It's just Matt and I tonight, but I think we're gonna go out and find some live music. We got plenty of recommendations where we should go. There's just so much to do here. It's pretty awesome. So far, the Conrad has been out of this world, beautiful, and it's in walking distance of a lot of great things. It's not the heart of downtown, which is nice because 
if you're looking at hotels right in downtown, they are very expensive. So this is a couple miles out from that and just a little bit cheaper, which is super nice. So um, yeah, no, we are gonna go to, I think Miranda Lambert, um, her bar and restaurant tonight. And I was looking at reviews and what we should get and their queso guacamole looks awesome. So we're gonna have to get some of that. We decided to hit up one of the restaurants at the Conrad, Nashville. This was on the first floor and then they also have one on the third floor, but this one serves a really good breakfast and I ended up going with the avocado toast and Matt got the blueberry pancakes which looked delicious. After breakfast, we made a quick 45 minute drive to go on a tour about Andrew Jackson. And I quickly realized that I really missed Michigan weather. That's where I'm from. And I miss leaves like this. It was just so nice to walk around and hear the leaves crunching below my feet. The tour lasted about two and a half hours, and if you didn't know, Andrew Jackson was our seventh president from 1829 to 1837. And this tour was great. It was very educational, both the good and the bad. But I quickly realized why I didn't take too many college classes with Matt, and that's because he asked so many questions. <laughs> But it was cool to see all of these original uh, pieces of furniture, that bed that you just saw. Andrew Jackson actually died in that bed. Kind of good and bad parts of American culture. So anyways, now we're going to go eat and then we're going to head downtown. Oh, no, the Grand Old Opry first, which is a very historical place in Tennessee regarding music and the history of country music in Nashville. So we'll bring you along. Matt said that he wanted to build a colonial house after that, so let's uh, hold him to that. Yeah, and we'll get a statue of Lene right at the entrance of my house. So, We're not doing that. Okay. I'm laying on the bed because I'm so car sick. Oh, I used to never get car sick, and now, well, I guess I never ride in the back of the cars, but we're Ubering everywhere. It was like a 40 minute drive to where we had that tour and back. Oh, I'm dying. And we have to go down that way again tonight. So, Ugh. comment below if you get car sick. I never really experienced this. And I also discovered I get seasick too. So that's new after having babies. Yeah, babies just really mess up your bodies. <laughs> in 
Nashville, Tennessee. Welcome to the longest running show in radio history. The show that made country music famous. Welcome to the Great Mountain. Well, when she wrapped her loving arms around my neck on the dance floor at Chelsea's bar, I should have turned her away. But how was I to see? I was firing, she was gasoline. Both sad and lonely after what death had done But like rattlesnakes kicked across the ground Our true loves were dead and our hearts were full of grief I was firing, she was gasoline, good God I was firing, she was gasoline Last night we went to the Grand Old Opry and we didn't recognize any of the country singers, so we didn't really know what to expect. Uh, but it was, well it is, Breast Cancer Awareness Month, and Garth Brooks showed up at the end, which was a huge surprise and just so fun, and made everybody's night. Um, so that was so worth it to go there. It was about like a 40 minute drive, again, from our hotel, so we kept going like back and forth, back and forth throughout the whole day. Um, but that was so awesome. And we then headed down to Broadway Street, which is where all like the live music is. And we stayed out there dancing, country dancing, listening to all the different singers about like one in the morning, which doesn't happen very often anymore for us because we're like old. So super fun. We enjoyed it. We slept in. I washed my hair. And now we are headed. We're walking to go pick up scooters. There's scooters everywhere around the city. And you can just get the app on your phone. Um, and uh, you can pick up a scooter and then go wherever you want and it'll just charge you on your phone, obviously. So we're gonna do that. We're gonna go meet up with our friends, go out to lunch, go shopping, do all the things. So we'll take you along and show you what there is. So people just leave them around the city and then you have to search for them and you can claim one and take them for a ride. So you need to which one? Your app. Okay. And then you scan the QR code. That's pretty cool. We're gonna head into Uncommon James. I've always wanted to go here. Oh my gosh, it is crowded. Holy cannolis. Jesse James Decker store. Super excited. I remember when she opened it. Huge fan. I love her old show and she's currently on the Dancing with the Stars, which is awesome. I hope she can uh, start her show again because that was awesome. Yay!
We ended our last night eating at Midtown Cafe. I highly recommend getting the scallops and lobster mac and cheese. Of course, we had to do some line dancing and hear the band at Valentine's. I wasn't able to record even half of the things we did, but I think that's okay because I was enjoying Nashville to the absolute fullest. Thanks for the good time, Nashville. We will be back.